The Parallel Versions window is a good tool to compare passages in more than one version or compare passages in the same version. There are a couple ways you can use to open the Parallel Versions window. Click on Tools here and choose Viewing the Text in Parallel Versions window. This dialog box will help you to pick versions. So let's say we wish to compare our passage in the King James Version and the New American Standard and the English Standard Version. I'll click KJV and Add, then find the NAS. Click Add, and then find the ESV, and click Add. Now that those three are there, I'll click OK. To keep the verses in sync, if you wish to move back and forth in the passages, use these buttons here for next verse, next chapter, or next book. Sometimes you might move a bit forward in the chapter. You can always click Synchronize Browse Windows to bring them back into synchronization. The buttons give you a number of tools to change the display of the versions in the Parallel Versions window. You can also add an Analysis window for the bottom of particular windows as well. There's a faster way to open the Parallel Versions window. If you know the abbreviation of the versions you wish to display in the Parallel Versions window, just click in the command line, type the letter P, and then KJV, NAS, ESV, and hit Enter. Or if you wish to compare English to Hebrew and Greek, P, LXT for the Septuagint, NETS for the Septuagint translation into English, NRS for the New Revised Standard Version, and WTT for the Hebrew, then hit Enter. If you wish to add an analysis window to one of the columns there, click within it and click Toggle Analysis Window. The order that you type your versions in will determine the order that the Parallel Versions window displays. You can even compare a number of books in the same version. Type P and the same version multiple times for how many windows you wish to have in the Parallel Versions window. I'll use this to view the opening of several of Paul's letters and compare them.